this little child is always playing with this madman whenever he's on his way to school. Whenever they play for some time, he will give him some bread. He gave him little bread and he played with him. He gave it to him and the madman collected it. He cut more for him and stretches his hand towards the madman and the madman collected it. And he also gave him a drink to drink. The madman opened it. So he starts eating and drinking. He's so happy that the boy is always giving him food and the boy was so happy seeing the madman happy. The madman drank for a while and later returned the drink back to the boy. And immediately the boy collected his drink and put it back to the basket. He left and he said goodbye. The madman also said goodbye. So they keep waving each other until they didn't see themselves again. It is another day of school. The boy was going to school and he met the madman sleeping. He decided to walk slowly for the madman not to notice. He picked an object and then start using it to touch the madman. The madman thought it's ant or something. And then he did it again. And the madman stood up. And he smiled, seeing the boy. The boy dipped his hand in his basket and gave him a drink. And the madman was so happy. And then the boy says goodbye. He left for school. And the madman was so happy with the drink. He waved the boy and tried to open the drink. Hold your ear. I heard that you always play with one madman. Are you getting me? Please look. I don't want to see you close to that madman again. Did you hear me? Yes, daddy. Did you hear me? Yes, daddy. Did you hear me? Yes, daddy. How many times did I ask you? Three times. Okay, go. So the father warned him not to go close to the madman anymore. And the boy left for school. On his way, he found out that the madman is not there. He walked towards where the madman always sits. And then he sat to wait for the madman. He sat for a while, stood up and sat again. He kept waiting for the madman. And few minutes later, he looked around but didn't still see the madman. And then he stood up and he left so sad to school. So on this faithful day, his father decided to bring him back from school himself. And a man with a gun told him to bring the child, pointing gun at him. He dropped the child and the kidnapper took the child and told him to move without looking back. The man agreed and started moving. And then a stick hit him from the back and his gun fell. The man looked back and see that he's on the floor. And we saw a hand pick the gun from the floor. So the man tried to take his gun, but the father of the boy took him. So it was the madman that hit him from the back. So you see in life, everyone is useful. Nobody is useless. So thanks for watching this video. 
tell us where you are watching from so we can send you a hug and appreciate you. God bless you.